discuss about determine the target OS through a passive footprinting. So operating system information is crucial for every ethical hacker. Ethical hackers acquire the details of the operating systems running on the target machine by performing various passive footprinting techniques and obtain other information such the city, country, latitude, longitude, host name, operating system, IP address of the target organizations. So here we will gather target operating system information through a passive footprinting using the Senesis web service. So what is Senesis web services? Senesis is web service similar like a showdown. So uh, we will go to now Senesis website and uh, target any web, uh, any one of the host. Okay, let's uh, click on the Senesis. Senesis.com. So we need to search now Senesis. So I can use here. Uh, directly like search dot senesis dot io so here we get the senesis information now we need to target some uh, type of websites like I use my own websites or else you choose any type of websites here so I can try with the uh, hackrf1.com and I can search no, no. Like this hack the box dot eu Here we'll get the display the information how we can get. Uh, we need to select any one of the uh, IP address here, and that will displays under the basic information sections. You can observe the OS, Ubuntu's, and many things. Apart from this, you can also observe the details such as uh, protocols running, software host, keys, etc. This information can help attackers identifying the potential vulnerabilities and finding effective exploits to perform various attacks on the target organizations also. So you can see here uh, summary uh, SSH is enabled for this. So you can try SSH with IP address okay and uh, you can crack the SSH password or you can uh, directly use the CVE exploit for SSH bypass under the root terminal you can get the access of their systems of this Ubuntu and you can dump the data also many things and explore what we can explore in this explore CRT domains and anything Uh, let's zoom parser the names name dns name service certificate service tls certificate leave efp sha you can see such the history we need to log in with uh, username and password and who is that need to uh, login information so this is how gathering the passive information through a footprint footprinting thank you guys for watching have a nice day